This is Bangor Tom Mall. Let's go check it out. Come. It smells incredible. Someone is cooking with, with basting sauce. Uh huh. And fire and onions and meat. And this is a proper grill with fire on it. Oh, look at it dipping into the basting. Oh, yeah. Bangor Tom Mall. And look. There's no guy checking your temperature or people having to wear masks. That was the last time we were here. I wonder if it's changed at all. Still got Father Christmas and Jack, they got a fire. Ha <laughs> fire. Crazy. Oh, look at the kitten and the little puppy. That's adorable. Oh, wow. And despite what anybody else might tell you, this is still the biggest mall because it's got the most amount of shops in it. And shops are important for a mall. Hey Rick, look, look up ahead. They're the plants. No, no, no. What are those? Okay, even I'm going to stop and have a look at that. Oh, How wow. Cool is that? Close call. Because there's no way Ricky can wear shoes that are that high up. <laughs> but the place is just like full of shops. Mm -hmm. And all of them open and stuff, which is pretty cool. But I just can't find the food lovers, and that's what I was actually looking for. I think it might be stuck on the other side somehow. Yeah, I just hope. Wow. It is. So amazing. There are so many clothing shops, jewelry shops, you name it shops. Have they got the Belladonna? Do you think they have the, the, the shoe Probably. cleaner? Probably. Of course, your usuals. Body and soul. Oh, is there Quicksilver as well? And there's a cinema. Movies. Yeah, it's dude land, but if you're Afrikaans, life is do it. <laughs> yeah, I didn't actually even think about that because the, the, the logos are dodo. Do it, do it, they, they have dodo, so as dead as a dude land. <laughs> wow, subtle. Stretch, a bit of a stretch, but you know. Mm -hmm. We had Quicksilver and have a look here. That's why the market always has the cheap ones because they are made in Mauritius. Proudly made in Mauritius. Ah, awesome. They actually have some quite cool shirts as well. Why don't we ever see these ones in the market? Oh, everything's flickering for me. I don't know how it is. It, it's it's like it's like a massive TV screen, and it's huge. I actually thought it was a picture, but it's a TV screen. That's massive, Eric. Really nice. What I like about uh, Bagatelle is it's it's a used mall. People actually come here. They actually come and do their shopping and stuff and come to eat. It's not a novelty. It's functional. It's part of Mauritius. I suppose that's what malls really are in Mauritius. It's, you don't have to park on the side of the road. They have parking. It's air conditioned, so it's cool. Um, and I suppose that's why they, they suddenly started springing up a lot of them at the moment because they're just comfortable. They're easy to shop and you, they have everything you need. Mandos. Yeah, it's actually full. There's an actual queue out the door for Nando's. Wow. People love chicken. Ah. Yeah, there is plenty of choice. This is a Steers. There's a Taste of Asia. Make great pad thai there at one time. Debonair's. Sen and Kem. Loads of places. There's a sandwich place and a panini place and a... Oh, Panerotti's KFC Ocean Basket. Seems like everything it's is like here. South Africa, one food court. <laughs> it is. Uh, yeah, they are South African. Well, not KFC. Mug, mug and bean. They have a mug and bean. <laughs> and while while I'm here, I'm going to point it out. <laughs> bagatelle. It's not the real bagatelle, everyone. It's just a, it's just a fake chimney. The real bagatelle is actually at the bagatelle lake. And we did a video. We'll check it. We'll leave a card on one of these sides. The card will pop up now that says, "Oh, and this is the real bagatelle mall." Great piece of not Paul and Virginie. Not Paul and Virginie. Paul and Virginie when they were little. How do you know it's not them? Because of the umbrella. Didn't they have umbrellas back in Paul and Virginie's time? Oh. But we've decided to come here if they have space. Spur. We're gonna do a comparison. I don't know what spur it is. Bagatel. Is it bagatel? They don't have like I don't know, we'll find out. Go inside. Patchy spur, it's called a patchy. Patchy, awesome. Well, cool. So you can actually see them making it down there. Have a look at all this stuff. I mean, this is a proper grill with fire on it. Oh, look at it dipping into the basting. Oh, man. This is why you come to spare because of the flame grillsness of it. 
this is where they actually make them. They take onions, they do something magical to them, then they dip them in flour, and then they deep fry them. And then they end up being Spurs famous onions. What is pretty cool is that it's all out. You can come down and check it all out yourself. Watch them cooking exactly what you ordered. Fantastic. <laughs> What a team! I'm playing for what a team this is! <laughs> I've just been recruited! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, really nice big spur. Ow! Not that big. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see all the parking available. To a spurlicious experience. Cheers everyone. Oh man, it's, it's arrived. Solomon! Solomon! Bringing the treats. Oh wow. wow. Thank you. Yes, it is spur. They have the pink sauce. Oh wow. Yeah. It does say fry dressing. Yeah. And a no name. <laughs> Spoiler. <laughs> Look at these starters. For me, this is what spur does the best. Mushroom. The tartar sauce. You don't pop the whole thing in your mouth. Mm. It's like actually got a mushroom in it. Mm. Well, that actually looks like a mushroom. Mm. Like, a, is it a whole mushroom? Mm -hmm. Oh, awesome! Very nice. I've just noticed that the whole plate is actually the the drums, okay. the little drums. I like the other ones. Mm. It's really good, but it doesn't have the, the turkey sauce, you know what I mean, the dunking mm -hmm. sauce. But the flavor is really great, and they're soft. Soft and juicy. Mmm, garlicky. They smell good. Mm. It's like got parsley in it. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm. Crunchy on the outside, soft and juicy in the middle? All soft. <laughs> I must say, the service at the spur in Russia is absolutely top notch. Yes. Is absolutely oh, look at that. A wonder. Just as we mention it, uh -huh. more serviettes. Oh, the food has arrived. Cool. Oh, look at so, this is the double beef. Yeah. Oh, look at the pile of onion rings. I oh, mean, they bring the onion rings here, they really do. And that's a goodie burger, not even sure what a goodie burger is. It's got pineapple, cheese, pineapple. mushroom sauce. Pineapple, cheese and mushroom sauce. Huh. And then you got ribs. Ho oh, ho! But first you... Here come the rest. Ho oh, ho! Thank you. Oh, and have a look at that steak. Oh, that looks With lovely. With the prawns and the cheese and... Oh, so many. Oh man, they look so good, so Rick. Even at Spur, we're going to spend time to take the photos. Because <laughs> look how beautiful it is. It is, that looks so good, hey, Rick? Ah, oh, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> I actually get a picture of your burger. This is the steak with the cheesy garlic mushroom topping, which looks amazing. With the prawn and cheese. All about the flavor. Oh, oh, oh. Nice big mouthful, Rick. Isn't it hot? What a great place. Mm. And a prawn, massive prawn. Mm -hmm. They're actually quite big prawns on there, and there are quite a few of them. Mm. Really, really good. Oh, awesome. That's fair. A burger comes deconstructed, as it were. Yeah, they, they put it to one side, so what do you do? Do you slam it on top? I think so. Do you want to eat it like a burger? Yeah. <laughs> you got to be quick, otherwise your tomato tries to escape. <laughs> <laughs> that looks pretty good. It, it does. It actually looks like a proper burger now. Uh -huh. Cheddar milk, that's cheese and mushroom. Mm. Oh it's wow. A, it's a really big, mm. juicy patty. This one's very thick and it's juicy. It's got a great flavor. Mm. And actually, mine is actually perfectly cooked. Mm, it does look great. Yeah, this is... It's not overcooked at all. Yeah, wow. Um, I'm not getting much mushroominess. I'm going to have to have another bite just to make sure. Creamy. Cheesy, creamy. Good. I'd rather have the crumb mushrooms on top. <laughs> but the burger is... 
classic as well. Yeah, no, this is what I always do. So it just feels like it's at home, and then you get it. It's like got the the sauce on it. Mm -hmm. They say it's chip sauce, but it's also the crispy it's onion, onion sauce. sauce. Mm -hmm. mm. That's a taste of spur on a plate in your mouth. Mm. Ribs, of course we had to at spur. Absolute classic. It really is. Is the basting sauce right? Are they soft and tender? Whoa, Are they... Look soft. Have a look, you can actually see the smoke ring. Or smoke whatever it's called, where you got the pinkiness. Mm. Oh man. Mm. They smell amazing. Oh, if you have any good. Mm. Fall off the bone, but still got that little bit of chew. Ah. Well, flame grilled, as you can see. Mm -hmm. Blackened on the back. Mm. Good. I'm impressed. I'm well impressed. Burgers. Ribs and grills. Combos. Steak, of course. Classics, sauces, schnitzels, chicken, and seafood for some reason. I don't know why you would do that. <laughs> Salad. <laughs> oh, starters. On, yeah. the, on the wrong side. We'll end with starters. Yeah, well, it's awesome. Sharing things. Mexican. Nachos. Toasted baguette, of course, because we're in Mauritius. You're probably not going to find that in South Africa. Wraps and sandwiches. And a little dessert section. Look at what Ricky found. Grilled quarter duck. Well, that looks pretty nice. That actually it? looks really good. Yeah, we're going to have to turn off here. I uh, head to Market Street, 42 Market Street. Down here somewhere. It's not really signposted. There are a lot of brand shops. I think that's Lacoste, Fila, Gap, Zippy of course. <laughs> oh, I don't know who Zippy is, but they're here. But loads and loads of branded shops. I'll zoom out so we can get a bit of Ricky under the 42. It's got a cool industrial feel there, Rick. Let's go ahead and have a look. Oh man. Yeah, stainless steel, beams, exposed ceilings, very industrial feel. Oh, I smell, I smell cooking, cooking sweet, sugar. Very sweet sugar smell. <laughs> awesome, it's like a sock shop. Look at the size of these little socks, like minute little socks. Wow, you can get custom cell phone covers. And I suppose things printed on things. Yeah, they're just loads of places making things here. Bun my sandwiches and fruit juices and salad bar. I don't know, there's just so much stuff, food down here. It's actually... This is a really interesting store because it's the pottage one. Pottage means I can't actually remember, but the guy explained it to me. But look at it this here, right? So it's this here. And then across here is more of it. And then there's a bakery on that side. So it's like it's, it's a store divided into pieces inside other stores. I don't think I've ever seen that. I know they exist, but those are like Cape Gooseberries. Wow. You can actually buy them in a tub. Columbia. Oh, Colombian Cape Gooseberries. Yeah. Different um, sort of egg container. And they've even got some pellets in the dark. Food lovers. Licorice, all sorts. They've got a full chocolate version. And just fruity. And just the fruity ones. But what are these? Waitrose does licorice, all sorts as well. Very Interesting. Good. These are the most plastic flowers I've ever seen. Are they real? Are they real, Rick? Yeah. Are you sure? Definitely. Loads and loads of fruits here. Well, what's that interesting thing? It's a mousse. Peeled grapefruit, yeah. Cool. Oh. oh yeah, it's almost mango season. Damn, but loads of fruits, veggies. Oh, this is pretty cool. Keep your greens in separate little... It's very neat, 
I like it. They actually have the lines with dips here. Yeah, for sure. And sour cream. That's awesome. Ooh, sour cream, yeah. Oh, and they've got the cream cheese and cottage cheese. I don't think wow. I've ever seen that in Mauritius. There are loads of steaks here, but check out these lamb roasts. Okay, wow. And some lamb chops. And chicken, of course. Loads of meat. And they got salmon. They're doing a whole salmon at the moment. Oh, they got these prawns. Beautiful fresh prawns, yeah. Wow. Oh, they look really oh, good. Hi. Bonjour. She's busy cutting the salmon at the moment. It's like a whole big piece of salmon. And they also make sushi here. Do they make sushi? Yes, yes they do. Yeah, yeah. They have sushi there. They got loads of different types of sushis. Oh man, simply sushi. So of course all your waitress, beautiful pickle, all kalamata olives. Artichoke hearts, everything your heart desires, you can get it in, Amer in Mauritius, in America. Loads of jams and things, and look, the Canadian maple syrup, but this is something you don't see in Mauritius much. Uh huh. Golden syrup, wow. Actual golden syrup. But look at some of these jams. You've got like a fig jam. Okay. And uh, gooseberry preserve, yeah. Uh -oh. Gooseberry preserve. And oh, mo Morello cherries, I think, you know what that oh, is? Stem ginger. Stem mm -hmm. ginger. Yeah. How much is it? Okay. Oh, you, got some cereals, coffees, and teas. But you got all these different types of coffees like Kenya AA and Rwanda and Ethiopia and Colombia and El Salvador, Costa Rica, like from everywhere, all over the world, coffees. The bakery leads on to one of my favorite things the nut bar, where all the nuts hang out. <laughs> so, if you're missing any products while you're in Mauritius, come check out the food lovers. You'll probably find it here. Just wait, come have a look here. Particularly if you're from South Africa and you like your Mrs. Balls. They got all the different brands. Oh, and the Brussels and Visto. Wow. Oh yeah, you saw us there a little bit earlier, but check out what they got here. You can actually get the sauces. Spur pepper sauce. Now the pepper sauce is really good. Spur cheese sauce. And it's like 130 rupees. Now, sometimes if you're lucky and you come here, you can find some unusual chips. Rashes, I suppose, prawn shells. But look at this, steak and onion flavored snack. Yeah, awesome. What a great ice cream selection. And that doesn't even say ice cream, it just like looks like coffee. It's amazing. Man, they really do look Turkish good. Turkish delight. You have a Turkish delight ice Raspberry cream. Raspberry truffle. Oh man. Look at this, <gasps> like like pies, American style pies. French lemon tart, apple pie. And loads of seafood bits. And it, it has a little of everything. Hello. These look like sweets and things, right? But have a look here, it says beef stew. I think it's for children. Blueberry like pear baby. Bricky, yeah, so it's like a purity, but like this. Oh, oh is it for like babies? Seven plus months. Oh, okay. Oh. Or if you're feeling lazy. I thought, you know, I actually want to eat one. For sure. <laughs> Pears and prunes and but the, the the beef stew really fascinates me. <laughs> Chicken yeah, I got a little sidetrack, but look at all these nuts and sweets. Oh those pink and white sweets. And and grains and, and the cranberry mix. Chocolates fitting in quite nicely with the Waitrose Scotch blends <laughs> and the champagnes and the wines and things. And loads of all oh, marshmallows. But anyway, loads of chocolates and some good wines. Some pretty interesting things in there, right? Yeah, no, have a look. We've got like uh, flat leaf parsley. This is frozen, garlic, right? Yeah. Ginger. Oh, look at the jalapenos. Onions, everything chopped beautiful for you. Chopped for you stuff. And then a whole bunch of interesting things on your walk out. Gluten free what what's and biscuits and chips and great selection of what have yous. Loads of eating places, super cool. Even a truck. Apple tea, nice. So many boba. 
but they all have different flavors like uh -huh. lychee and pineapple Cheese. and wow and poisson that poisson flavor poisson poisson is that fish, fish <laughs> turns out it was just boring passion yeah not, <laughs> not fish at all we just can't read <laughs> And you're right here by the beautiful Maka Range. It really is a lovely, lovely shopping center. Hagen Dust, they actually make their own cones for their ice cream. And off to the next one. Oh wow, just like wound it into that. Oh, look at that. Someone's getting a fresh hot one for their ice cream. Oh, Hagen Dust, awesome. Oh, wow. Bagatel. I'm all with it all. <laughs> oh, wow. Anyway, everyone, thanks for watching. See you again next time.